Have you ever felt like you're constantly overspending on groceries? Do you struggle to stick to a budget when it comes to food shopping? It can be so frustrating to see your hard-earned money disappearing at the checkout, especially when you're trying to save or pay off debt. It's a common problem, but it doesn't have to be. In this video, we'll be sharing 5 smart ways to save on your grocery bill and take control of your spending. It's easy to feel overwhelmed when it comes to overspending on groceries, but the good news is that there are solutions. Here are 8 specific and actionable steps you can take to start saving on your grocery bill. Step 1. Create a budget and stick to it. This will help you stay on track and make sure you're not overspending. Use apps like Mint or WineAb to help you create and track your budget. Set aside a specific amount of money for groceries each week or month, and make sure to stick to it. Step 2. Make a list before you go shopping. This will help you stay focused and avoid impulse purchases. Plan out your meals for the week and make a list of the ingredients you'll need. Only buy what's on the list, and try to avoid the temptation to add extra items. Step 3. Shop at discount and warehouse stores. Stores like Aldi and Lidl often have lower prices on a variety of products, including fresh produce and meats. Check out these stores even if you're not a fan of their brands, you might be surprised at the quality and price of their products. Warehouse stores like Costco, Sam's Club, and BJ's often offer bulk items at lower prices than traditional grocery stores. While you may have to buy larger quantities of certain items, the overall savings can be significant. Plus, these stores often offer their own brand of products, which can be just as good as national brands but at a lower price. Step 4. Buy in bulk. Purchasing items like rice, beans, and grains in bulk can save you money in the long run. If you don't have a lot of storage space, consider splitting bulk purchases with a friend or family member. Look for bulk deals, such as buy one, get one free or lower prices for larger quantities. Step 5. Use coupons and discount codes. Before you head to the grocery store, be sure to search for coupons and discount codes that you can use to save money on your purchases. You can find coupons online, in the Sunday paper, or even on the back of receipts. You can also use apps like Ibotta or Checkout51 to earn cash back on your purchases. Don't just use coupons for items you are going to buy anyway. Look for deals on items that you might not normally purchase. Don't forget to use your loyalty cards at the grocery store. Many stores offer discounts and rewards for frequent shoppers. Buy generic or store brand products. National brand products can be more expensive than generic or store brand products, but they can be a fun and budget-friendly way to mix things up. Consider using a meal planning app like plan to eat to help you plan and organize your meals. Here are a couple little discussed tips to save money on groceries. Use a credit card with cashback rewards. Many credit cards offer cashback on purchases made at grocery stores and other retail locations. By using one of these cards, you can earn money back on your grocery purchases, which can add up to significant savings over time. 
just make sure to pay off your credit card balance in full every month to avoid paying interest and save as much money as possible. Take advantage of employee discounts. Many stores offer discounts to their employees, and even if you only work a few hours a week, you can still qualify for these discounts. Some stores also offer discounts to the family members of their employees, so you can save even more. To find out if your favorite store offers employee discounts, ask a store manager or check the store's employee benefits website. This can be a great way to save on your grocery bill, especially if you shop at the store frequently. By following the steps and tips we shared, you can start to see significant savings on your grocery bill. From meal planning and shopping sales to using cashback credit cards and taking advantage of employee discounts, there are plenty of ways to cut down on your grocery expenses. So if you want to continue learning about personal finance and money saving strategies, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more valuable financial knowledge videos. Together, we can take control of our finances and make smart money decisions to reach our financial goals.